What's going on everybody? It's Quincy Becky Beasley. I just realized that new DLC came out for Project Car, so I figured I'd give you a, a face cam kind of sort of thing, show you my riding setup, and also show you the guys the new DLC cars that came out. I'm pretty excited. Hopefully I'll give you guys a little kind of Chris Harris like feel about it. But let me know what you feel about these cars down in the description. I feel like it's a great price even if the cars aren't very good. At $299 for a pack of cars is pretty great considering they don't want to nickel and dime their players a lot. So with that, let's get started. I'm going to check out these cars. So I'm just going to do a solo track day. Just a quick race. Let's go ahead and pick our cars out. Now, I need to actually look to make sure what cars they are right quick. I'll be right back. And I'm back. So, the cars that you get with this 299 pack are the Bentley 8-speed and Continental GT3. And you also get the Le Mans winning BMW V12 LMR and a McLaren F1 GTR. I feel like I'm going to try the Bentleys first and end on the GTR. From McLaren. I figured it'd be on the GT. Bentley. Here goes our Continental GT3. I like it a lot. Uh, <laughs> there's not many colors. I'll go to number eight. That's my second favorite number. So let's go ahead and get started. Ooh, throat is parched. Right, it doesn't really matter what position you start in. I just want to give you guys a good looking feel of it. I do play with the GT3 wheel. Uh, it was a PlayStation 3 wheel. I do have a custom setup for my force feedback. It's more it's more drift happy. Wow, I like this a lot. This car is pretty good. It feels tight. Brakes are brakes really well. Got a little tail happy on me right there. Wow. The, wow. The only other car I've been able to do that in was in the F1 car. Pretty well handling. I like this car a lot. It's very well balanced. You can definitely mash it on the gas coming out of the turns. Oh, almost lost it. I say that. I say mash on the gas, <laughs> and then I run into the wall. Oh man, this is pretty sweet. I am liking this a lot. A little tail happy. I can't wait to. I can't. I hope they get something like a Corvette or something in here. That would be amazing. Let me stop talking because I can't talk and drive apparently. I keep forgetting the shift. I keep forgetting the shift. Oh shit. Well that is it for the first one. That is the GT3. We're going to check out the 8 speed Continental next. Wow that cockpit. <laughs> I would only drive on cockpit if I had uh, the trip, the full monitor surrounds. That's the only way I would be able to drive in the cockpit. Oh, this thing is a beast. I don't, uh. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> my goodness. This thing wants to go all over the place already. This thing's a freaking monster. I gotta like feather the gas. Now this is my first time out with this car. Like I have no experience with this car. I'm not very good. This is like one of my worst tracks. I'm one of my worst performing tracks. It's not very tail happy. It's very sidewinder happy. Like, I'm gonna have a hard time keeping this on the road. But 
man, they can corner like the best of them. Holy crap. Oh, yeah. All right, I think I got the hang of it now. Let me see if I can try to get one good lap in. 170 on the straight. 180. Wow. <laughs> okay, I think I got the hang of it now. Trying to see how late I can break. Oh man, this thing is fickle. When you're going that fast, oh man, a slight movement of the wheel. And you're all over the place. You're already fighting what you did. Oh, break leg. Oh, the hill. Ah! <laughs> nice recovery, though. Oh. Come on, bro. I'm a late breaker. I'm a late breaker. Woo! Oh, this thing is fast. Holy crap. I know this dude is like so mad right now. Oh, in the road. Yeah, I could drive a little bit better, but I want to give y'all guys the first experience of me driving it, and I have, I've never driven this car before, and it's a little bit hard to handle. <laughs> so now I know how car reviewers feel. So this thing is fast as hell. Let's see if we can hit one, go over 180. Before the turn. Oh, pansy. Oh. <laughs> so that's the eight. That's the Bentley eight speed. This car is a lot of fun. Wow, this would this car alone would be worth the two ninety nine. Let's do a burnout. <laughs> oh, Stop me off the session. <laughs> All right, we're back. So hopefully the force feedback works. It's not gonna freak out on me. Let's make sure we're... I wanna go to somewhere with the better straightaway. All right, I'm gonna make the control pretty soon. There we go, force feedback. Oh! I have noticed this that some cars, when you immediately come out... Wow, this thing sucks. When you come out of pits, it'll immediately want to send you into the wall. Oh god, I hope they don't have any community challenges with this, because I suck with it. <laughs> I'm so terrible with this. Forgive me, BMW. I'm an Audi fan. Oh, I am complete garbage right now. Holy balls, is it fast? I'm gonna mess up this turn right here, too. I already feel it. Can't tell you how many times I messed it up in career mode. Overtake, baby. My house. Okay, I'm starting to get it now. Ah, uh, hit itches. I got this. Oh, yeah, talk I say I got this and I end up in the sand. <laughs> oh my goodness. This car is freaking fast as hell. The acceleration in this is insane. But oh man, it can it can you give her enough gas, it can 
it can just fly right in between the turns like on this Nuremberg ring. It's like it was it's like it was built specifically for this course, but we know that was for the Mons are I'm just gonna end it there. We've got one car left. That is the McLaren F1 GTR. I heard this thing is a pain in the ass to drive. From what I've read. I've been at this for about an hour, so sorry for drinking on camera, but I'm really thirsty and my throat's getting parched. Alright, so let's do this. Love the paint scheme. Too bad I can't look around. Well, I'm loving it. Oh, I love the way you sit in the middle. Oh. oh. <laughs> God. Got a failure like this man. <laughs> I mean, it's a good car. It's fast. But I would never... I'll never pick it myself. No inner Chris Harris session right now. No inner Chris Harris. I wish though. <laughs> I just go this way. I told you I always end up breaking it. I always end up messing that part up. As evidence by the wear on my tires. Oh, that was way too wide for an overtake. Yeah, this is a lot of fun. Okay, so yeah, this is a really close second place. Now that I've actually driven the car, and I know its limits, where I can where I can hit the gas without making it spin out. But God, if I didn't have traction control right now. Always counter steer, my friends. God, it just wants to come from underneath you. Let's okay. Okay, come on, girl. No, <laughs> no, no power slide. Oh, got one. Hey, I made it. Let's see if I can get one good power slot in. Nope. Oh, got one. <laughs> Well, this has been Quincy Bear. Keep easy. Hope you've enjoyed a look at these cars. Let me know if you would want to grab these cars. Seems like a good deal. It's only it's only two ninety nine. Seems like a great deal for four really great cars. Even though I don't like the BMW, but for four really great cars, it seems like a screaming deal. So if you like it, go grab it now because there's more free DLC coming out in July. So I will see you next time. Bye.